All right, so that actually didn't take long. I found the door that I'm supposed to go through, so... Yes. How was I supposed to know that I had to go back to that door, man? Come on, man. Fucking A. This game gives you nothing. Hey, big guy. Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. I was hoping I'd run into you again. Alright. Good boy. Alright, pal. Come with me. Alright. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place. So, we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. Huh. Looks like we have a wolf as a guide dog, man. That's awesome. I'm still kind of pissed off that uh, the game has you walking around just randomly until you stumble upon where the hell you're supposed to go. Really, that's the first time in the game that I was completely lost. And I'm also getting really annoyed that these characters don't move faster. Like, they walk really slow. Like, even when you hit L1 to have them walk faster, it's still too goddamn slow. Yeah, well, I think Wolfie's gonna die at some point. I mean, it's pretty awesome that we have a wolf for a uh, companion now, but it's not very realistic either. I don't know any wolf that uh, you could just make friends with by petting it and giving it a freaking dog bone. A wolf is still a wolf. I hate the fucking camera angles in this game, man. You know the drill, let's go the other fucking way now, because we know that we're supposed to go that way, probably, so let me go this way. Huh. Hmm. 
The patients were first admitted to Blackwoods, blah, 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 results and symptoms. Huh. Okay, so that's just talking about the miners who probably turned into these creatures, actually. These miners probably turned into these creatures and then pretty much took over the sanitarium is what happened. Doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? Oh, what the hell is this? What went on here? This is nuts. Oh, the doctors were testing them. We are starving, freezing. I will make you pay. Stop testing us now. And it shows nine days. It looks like they didn't feed them for nine fucking days. So the doctors brought this, brought all this nonsense on themselves, it looks like. Oh, fucking idiots, man. So they knew something was up with the miners in this and they decided to run tests on them. Well, there's definitely going to be a creature in here. Yep, there it is, right there, man. It's climbing on the outside of the wall. The camera angle is complete shit right now. I mean, it's zoomed so far out, I could barely see Mike. What the fuck are, is up with these shitty camera angles, man? God damn. It's like the worst thing about this game is... Just horrible camera angles. Fucking garbage. Gonna make a game like this, you need to do better with the camera work next time. The only reason you should miss clues and stuff like that is because of the camera angles. You could probably blame it on the camera 100% of the time if you miss anything. I mean, look at this shit. I literally can't walk where I want to walk. The game pretty much dictates where you go. Fucking A. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. There's always a secondary way that you should go to, like, look for uh, clues and whatnot. I'm trying to figure out which is the primary way to go. Okay, that's, that's the primary way. I'm gonna go back here now and look for clues. Fucking bullshit. The game tries to troll you into going further than you should, and then you can't backtrack to look for clues.
that's what you get when you get moron doctors trying to run tests on people. Bunch of freaking idiots, man. <laughs> Leave it to science to fuck people up, man. Every single time, man. Doctors and scientists always create all of this madness. Which is kind of ironic. They're the people that are supposed to be helping everybody. Come on, man. I think it's hilarious that sometimes the characters will just walk right into a fucking wall. It kind of ruins the whole atmospheric mood of it all. What the hell is this? Oh, shit. Jesus, hot sauce Christmas cake. This is fucking unbelievable. Wow, say so they would just wait until these guys would turn into these creatures, man. Well, they bit off more than they can chew, that's for sure. Shit, that looks creepy as hell. I'm just gonna look in the back of the room real quick. It looks like one of those things are like still strapped in a chair back there, man. Okay, here's the thing, that shotgun only carries two shells, and Mike hasn't reloaded since he shot it the first time, so how does that make any sense? Wow, I'm finding like a ton of clues. I've only missed three, three clues in the 1952 section. I missed quite a few on the mystery man. And I have like, I don't know, a few more totems to go before I collect them all. Huh, looks like I missed three clues on the, on the twins. That sucks. This guy. Sorry, I'll do it. Jefferson Bran or something like that. That must have been the doctor who was like behind this whole thing. See, like it would be very easy to miss all this stuff, you know, depending on which, you know, like which direction you like decide to walk. It would be easy to like miss all of these items. And I think the game developers set it up that way so people have to play multiple times trying to find all this garbage, but I'm a I'm a guy that I like to try to find every single little thing that I can the first time through. And then if I feel like it, I'll play the game a second time. 
Fucking A. Why do I feel like I'm missing something? I mean, I haven't found, like, any totems lately. I found one a while ago. But you would think that there'd be a totem or something in here. I have a feeling the last two chapters are going to be the longest chapters. Where did the dog go? <laughs> Fucking A. I'm getting stalked by that thing. There's the wolf over there. He's waiting for me. Uh, nothing over there. Where's the dog at? Did the dog make it in here? Uh, what are you doing? Is he going back out there? Dude, what the fuck? Fucking A, man. Why did he go back into this room? I don't understand. Son of a bitch. 
What the fuck, man? Where are you? So, I'm pretty much just watching this now. I'm not even playing. This is like a interactive movie at this point. Huh? Mike's being a, a complete fucking moron, man. What? I really like how he has uh, two that weapon and he has not reloaded it not one time. Time, boys. It's enough for me for all ya. It's starting to make perfect sense why uh, why they didn't want anybody going into the psych ward because the hospital was running all of these unauthorized, unethical, just messed up tests, man. That's turning all these guys into mutants, basically. So that's awesome. And, uh... I don't know, this was like a horrible place to buy a cabin. <laughs> I mean, I don't think you could pick a worse place than this. Alright, that was my fault. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here, and when we come back, we'll proceed on with Mike here. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to comment down below. And hit the like button, and we'll be right back with more until dawn. Thank you.